Hi, welcome to a new week of Climbing Daily. Coming up on today's show, we've got some random news from Mount Everest and some even more random climbing from Chris Sharma and Stefan Glowatz. First up, we've got a pretty amusing story from Mount Everest where the Nepalese government have introduced a rule that all climbers venturing beyond base camp on the mountain have to bring down eight kilograms of rubbish, not including their own trash, and anyone that doesn't do it could be fined or even face legal action. Whilst it's funny to think of climbers staggering down from the summit with eight kilos of rubbish strapped to their back, the reality is that the Sherpas from each expedition will just bring down enough rubbish to cover their team's quota, but either way, it's a step in the right direction. I've been to base camp a few times myself and it is filthy, so any attempt to clean it up should be congratulated. Good work, Nepalese government. For our second random story, we've got this really interesting video of two rock climbing legends, Chris Sharma and Stefan Glovax. Chris was arguably the best sport climber in the world for the best part of a decade, while Stefan has been a professional climber for over 30 years. What we do know is that the two have got a trip planned together that they're calling Into the Light, but beyond that, where it is or what it'll be, we know about as much as you. We will keep you informed though, but in the meantime, here's the video featuring some excellent mutual backslapping. Chris Sharma hat das Klettern für über Jahre, über zwei Jahrzehnte jetzt hinweg äh, auch, auch geprägt. Also das äh, ist eine lebende Legende mittlerweile in seinem Alter schon. Ich muss auch sagen, ich bin, bin stolz darauf, dass ich hier dieses Projekt mit ihm machen kann, weil er ist äh, nach Wolfgang Güllig und Kurt Albert äh, eigentlich das einzige große Vorbild von mir. Ja, yeah, we've just been in touch over the years and then he called me I guess a year ago or something was like, yeah, Chris, I've got this idea. I had no idea what it was, but I was really excited to do a trip with Stefan because we uh, planned, we've been talking about it for a long time. And, and also for me, you know, he's like, a, yeah, like one of my climbing idols from when I started climbing. Also wir haben ja noch nie was zuvor gemacht, aber wir sind uns das öfter mal so begegnet und uh, immer wieder haben wir dann von gesprochen, dass wir mal was zusammen machen wollen. Whatever these guys get up to, it is going to be massive. That's it from us today. Make sure you follow us on Facebook and Twitter. See you tomorrow. He has a great, fierce, open-faced passion for climbing and for the art of the natural world.